Hi, welcome to How to D&D. My name is Fred Weller and today I want to talk about Dungeons and Dragons 5e and the Unarmed Strike. Now, Unarmed Strikes for all the other classes works different to the Monk. So just, this, just remember this is the standard Unarmed Strike. You can find it on page 195 of the Player's Handbook. This is not for the Monk. The Monk works differently. So if we have a look in the book on Unarmed Strikes, it says, instead of using a weapon to make a melee weapon attack, you can use an unarmed strike. That could be a punch, a kick, a headbutt, or some other forceful blow, none of which is counted as a weapon. On a hit, an unarmed strike deals bludgeoning damage equal to 1 plus your strength modifier. So you don't roll damage for um, an unarmed strike because you're only ever going to do your strength plus 1 in terms of damage. You are always considered to be proficient with unarmed strikes. This tavern has the group um, hanging out, having some drinks. We have a fighter at the bar and a local dwarf starts to get lippy with him. And the fighter decides to throw a punch. Rather than drawing a sword and killing him by slicing him in half or anything like that, he decides he'll use an unarmed strike and tries to punch him. So if we have a look at our character sheet here, this is a level 1 character. So the first thing we want to do is have a look at the strength modifier for our fighter. Our fighter has a strength modifier of plus 3 because they have a strength score of 16. So that's 3, then you add your proficiency modifier, in this case it's 2 listed right here, which means essentially it is the same to hit for the great axe as it is for just a simple punch or kick for that fighter. So plus 5, or 5 is our attack bonus. We roll out 20 sided dice, we add the result, I get 3, 3 comes to 8, and 8 is our attack. Uh, then with damage, no rolling for damage, simply 1 plus the strength modifier for the fighter, which is 3, comes to 4. So you do 4 damage to the, the dwarf. Now in this case, uh, the dwarf has an AC of 10, so it would not hit. But, if I were to roll again, and do this all over again, roll a 14 this time, so the fighter swings another blow, and gets 14, that will come to 19. Okay, you can see 19 is more than enough to hit the armour class of the commoner um, hanging out in a pub, which is essentially this. Then you do 4 points of bludgeoning damage. Now you can decide to make that um, just knock out, knock out your dwarf, or if it would kill a dwarf, then you would kill a dwarf if you want to. Um, the dwarf probably doesn't have any more than about four hit points anyway. So that's essentially how the unarmed strike works for all the classes apart from the monk. The monk works differently, as I said. If you found this video helpful and informative, please share, like, and subscribe. Make a comment below if you have any questions about the unarmed strike, and I will do my best to answer those questions. Until next time, keep rolling those 20s.